Hey everyone, uh, Crazy Eye here. Uh, this is a quick tutorial or a quick guide for the new Xbox One built-in 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. Now, when I first got my Xbox, um, I got this this new controller, and I was trying to figure out what kind of headset is compatible with. Now, I know that the older Xbox controller, for example, this one, does not have the built-in headphone jack. It has a adapter where you have to insert this headphone that comes with the bundle or just the Xbox when you buy one. Um, this has this port right here where you can plug it in and able to control mute and you know volume up and down with that. Now the new controller, new controller, now I got this, uh, this Covert Forces when it came out and this one has a 3.5 millimeter jack. After many trial and error, I have come down to these final conclusions and my recommendations to what headsets will be the best and the budget friendly headsets that you, you guys can get. So I'm about to show you the, all the headsets that I've tried that works and doesn't work and show my recommendations of which one is the best. Okay, so the first headset or headphones I've tried with the new Xbox One, the 3.5 millimeter built-in headset controller is the iPhone, any iPhone, iPhone 5, iPhone 4, iPhone 6, their iPhone headset. Now, the iPhone headset has a built-in microphone and these controller, how it works is as long, I'm sorry that it's all tangled, but I'm, as long as you have these three striped input, two for audio and one for microphone, uh, audio left and right, stereo sound, and it should work. So I've tried it and my conclusion, it does not work because uh, there is no because. Um, when I plugged it in and I actually got into the game and tried to hear anything, no sound, just the buzzing, loud buzzing sound and the other end um, the, the recipient of the, uh, the volume, they said they, they can't hear anything. They just hear a lot of buzzing sound also. So my conclusion is that iPhone, the Apple iPhone, iTouch, whatever, their headphones do not work with the Xbox One built-in 3.5 millimeter controller. Okay, so, so far we have checked the iPhone, uh, the he headset that doesn't work. Second, we tried the Android, the, the Samsung Galaxy uh, headset, the headphone that I have, and it does work. And the Xbox One bundle or Xbox One console, when you buy it, it comes with that, the standard Xbox, uh, the chat headset, and that works for chatting only. <laughs> I have this old, old school headphone jack, uh, the, the headset that has volume control, you can make calls and most importantly, it has the three, one, two, three, the stripes uh, for two audio and one for microphone. And I tried it. I plugged it in and guess what? It works. Yes, you could hear the game audio at just the one side. So you'd be in the holding against your neck um, if you really want to use it. Um, but uh, it's fun. It's funny, right? But uh, uh, yeah, it does work. You could hear the entire game audio and the chat. And the microphone does work for chatting, but guess what? Again, with this controller, uh, not controller, with the, this headset, the volume does not work. But you could obviously hear the uh, game audio. Okay, so the next headset that I've tried was actually from Xbox 360. I bought a headset that was the uh, Poke Audio. Uh, it was Poke Audio Melee, and it was the, I think Melee was the actual <clears throat> the model name but i had purchased it and actually it connects to the the optical the audio optical in the back all that good stuff don't get me wrong that headset is awesome you get a clear stereo game sound with the you know it has a built-in mic all that good stuff and it's very comfortable and to show you it is here we go this one right here very comfortable um you, you know you, this 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 is actually the microphone and you can you know turn it off and turn it on and you can actually use it for your you know any music players you have you know iPhones iTouch 
uh, any MP3 players, even Galaxy phones, any Android, uh, Android operating system phones will work too. Now, it came with this cord that you can hook it to any uh, 3.5 millimeter uh, audio jack uh, devices. It does have the three, uh, three stripes. So I did try on, our, uh, the, on the uh, new Xbox, 3, uh, Xbox One controller. Plugged it in. I get the game audio and game audio sounds great. It sounds like a stereo audio. Um, great stuff. Now here's the thing, microphone, the microphone, even when I you know pull it out, whatever, I tried many times, microphone does not work. So the voice chatting is not gonna work, but the great head stereo, I mean great you know headset for the stereo sound, game, in-game stereo sound, it's a great headset, you could use it. So, you know, if you wanna play at middle of the night when you don't wanna bother anybody, here you go, another great choice. So if you have this for your old 360, Xbox 360, don't throw it away, don't sell it, you could use it. You can use it on your new controller. So the final headset I'm gonna show you is from Logitech. Now, I decided to purchase a pretty legit, pretty, you know, not too expensive, but you know, it has a good quality headset and it happens to be on sale at Best Buy. And I believe I got it for something around 35 bucks with price matching from Amazon. I think I saved like five bucks, but, I got this headset, I can show you the box, and here's the box right here, it's a Logitech uh, G430. Now this one is actually designed for PC, it's actually made for PC. Um, there were a couple forums that I found online, they, they said that it does work with PS4. Now PS4 has that 3.5 millimeter port on their controller, I, I don't have a PS4, but apparently it works, so you know what? I, t I decided the price was good, so I bought it. And here it is. This is the this this is this is it right here, and it's very comfortable. Uh, it has a great microphone. Uh, it has a good review. This this uh, headphone has a really good review, and everybody said you could hear loud and clear with the headset and PC game. Now, it if you look at it, it comes with the port at the end with audio, microphone, right? So in order to get this thing to work on your new controller is all you need to do is buy a splitter. The splitter is literally like two bucks. If Radio Shack hasn't closed down near your area, go get you one or Amazon has it for like $2 for prime two day shipping. Can't go wrong, get you one. Now to make sure that at the end, you have the three, uh, the three stripes because it divides into one microphone and one audio. And if you look at the imprint, I don't know if you can see it, kind of blurry, right? If you see the imprint, there is a like a, in a symbol of head jack, like a headphone and a microphone. If you get this, plug it in, then the other end, you just plug the right, you know, the right port. And now, I was hoping that this will work. Guess what? It does work, yes, it works great. I mean, this thing is, I mean, it has a great sound, Microphone chatting, no problem. People here just fine. The coolest thing about this one is that it has a built-in onboard controller. It has a volume plus and minus, and you can mute the mic or have a mic enable. This is very convenient because compared to the other headsets, headphones, you can't control that in the mid game. Only way to do it is you have to go out of your game, go to the Xbox One home screen, go to their settings and you have to control your volume through that setting. And it is pain in the butt because in the middle of the game you're playing and your game audio is too low but the chat is too high and you have to go back and keep, you know, play around. So I recommend that you test it out before actually you play the game. But this, you could do, you can control this on the fly. So during the game, you could use this to uh, adjust the volume on the fly, high or low, mute the microphone, enable the microphone on the fly. So I highly recommend, this is the my recommendation of headset if you wanna use it for Xbox One, the new 3.5 millimeter built-in head jack controller because budget friendly, very comfortable. You could also use it on PC, so it's a two for one. And if you have a PS4, you could also use it on PS4. Uh, I highly recommend this. 
because this does work with our new Xbox One controller. So uh, guys, I hope that this video was informative in any ways uh, because I had a hard time trying to figure out what headset was the best and I stream, you know, time to time I stream my gameplay and I would like to, you know, use my, you know, the headset that has the best game audio that I could hear and the chat microphone. And I've so far, I'm sure there's other great headsets out there, but so far this Logitech G430 has been my choice so far. And if you have any comments or questions, just uh, leave me a message and I will try to answer it because it, it, it's annoying. It's really frustrating to figure out what works and what doesn't work. So there you go, guys. Uh, this is Crazy Eye and I am out.